What's up guys? Welcome to my channel. If you're here for the first time, I have to say hi. My name is Frances Michelle. First video of 2020, it's going to be a planner related video. And with that being said, I'll let you know why I chose this to be my first video of 2020. So if you're not familiar with my channel, I recently transitioned from a beauty channel to more a lifestyle content, more mom life, and more of the things that surround myself on an everyday life, I'm sorry, on an everyday basis, and as well as my passions. So today's video is going to be my planner lineup for 2020. I decided to be this video to be my first video for 2020 just because I can tell you guys how I'm planning to organize my life and how, what are my dreams and what are my goals for 2020. So if you're new to my channel and you like planning, you like cleaning, you like mom life, then I suggest you stick around and hit subscribe and give me a follow on both of my Instagram's account. One is for my planner shop and the other one is for my everyday. They will be linked down below. So without further ado, if you guys wanna see what my planner lineups consist of, then let's go ahead and keep on watching. <laughs> All right, guys, I know how these videos go here on YouTube and I just hate when the video starts and everyone's talking and talking and talking and they don't hurry up and get to the planner. So we're gonna get into my planner system and what I'm going to be using for 2020 to keep my life on check, organized with my YouTube, both of my Instagrams, my planner shop and my life. So I have five things that I need to get in order, make sure everything is set. So I have here for now, four planner systems and you guys are going to be like francis four planners what the hell but i'm going to get deep into details into everything that i'm going to why i chose all these and what i'm going to be using them for so let's start with the first one let's bring those to the side let's go ahead and bring you guys closer oops sorry that's not all right, so my first one is this beautiful tiny mini happy planner right here. This is, no, this is the micro happy planner. And this one I've had it since last year. I started using it last year, um, the, big, the end of the, the year, and I kind of like what I'm using it for, so I'm actually going to stay with it. So this is just a little a micro happy planner, and most of the things inside, um, you can find them in my shop, and I created it. So I'm just gonna let you guys know. Um, these little micro happy planner have pretty much everything tiny. I love the dividers I created. These dividers, you can get yours uh, on my shop. I will link down below if you're interested in getting dividers for your uh, micro. I have them and I have a few options as to what you can do for the um, covers. So this mini happy planner, I keep calling her mini. This micro happy planner is the one that sits on my 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 purse all the time. So what this has is I have here uh, weekly. So pretty much this is my weekly in a nutshell. So I plan accordingly to my weekdays, as you can see. So it's just pretty much in a nutshell. I write down so I remember what I have to do that week and I throw it in my purse. I'm like, wait, I have to call here. I have to have a doctor's appointment because it is so tiny. It fits in my purse perfectly fine. So that's why I keep this as a personal, um, as a everything. So it's like an everything planner just to kind of have in my purse. So I have here what to buy. So I have my grocery shopping list here. Everything that I need to buy, I have it here. Um, I don't, we have a little tiny receipt i don't know what that's in there but this little today um it's also from my shop i have it also listed on my shop if you're interested and then here i have my notes so whatever comes to my mind whatever i have to do i um i write it here so anything that i have to do anything that comes to my mind i just throw it here so this is like my dump when it comes to everything so i have a doctor's appointment i have to pay my bills and this isn't that so this is just pretty much sits there in my purse as a everything planner so i have something in my mind that i have to do i know that i have to do back home i'm gonna write it here and then when i get home i go through it and then i put it in my planner that is um that is that is that it goes in if it's either work related or if it's either personal related then i transfer it to one of the planners that go but this is just pretty much my 
everyday go-to planner in my purse, sits in my purse, does not move from my purse, always in my purse, and I dump everything on here. So the second one, I recently ordered a new one. I was gonna use this one from last year. This is my uh, B6 Stalogy that I used last year. I kind of tried using it. it I kind of went back and forth between it, but I kind of fell off to be honest. So this is pretty much my last year's Stalogy. As you can see, I put things in here. This is from SNS Plants. This is pretty much from last year. And I really try, I really, really try this free thing going on. And I really did like it to be honest, um, but I never got to it. But I ordered a new one because the reason why is because I'm going to be using a B6 Stalogy. This is just going to be my idea planner or my idea notebook. So this is not going to have like, I, you can see this one has monthly, this one has a weekly tab that I created, um, a kids tab and a notes tab. It's just going to be a regular, regular notebook. And as the day goes by, if I have to, um, if I have to plan like this, if I have to plan like a Monday, like a Monday through Friday sort of thing, then I will go ahead and do it. And what I'm going to do with this is just going to be my idea um, planner. So it's going to sit in my desk and it's just going to be my idea. So on, let's say, let me see if I have a, I created one here. Okay, so let's say that this is what I created on Monday. I write down all the ideas that I have, everything that I have to do, especially work related, especially shop related. So all the ideas, I'm gonna put them in here. Um, everything is just gonna be like my, pretty much my idea dump notebook. Everything is gonna be in here. Um, what I do and everything. And I wanna keep it as like a, um, as a like a memory type thing so at the end of the year i can look back into it and see if all my ideas were put into paper or put into action um anything like that and i just gonna i just want to do it like like that like it's just gonna be like my idea notebook like i just want to put everything in here um no limits like i can put pictures i can put everything i just want this to be like this cool notebook with quotes and it's just pretty much everything my journal just idea dump that's what i'm just gonna call it my idea dump notebook and like i said it's not gonna be like a planner related it's just gonna be everything is gonna be thrown in here and then from there i move on to my other planners um reason why i want something like this to be honest on my on my desk is because when i am working in my shop or when i'm working on youtube or whatever i have a lot of ideas and i don't like to put them in my planner or i sometimes grab a piece of paper and write them in my piece of paper and then just leave them tossed but i kind of want to keep track of everything that i write all my ideas i want to put it down in notebook and at the end of the year i want to look back to it and i want to see how many things i have accomplished how many ideas that i had that i accomplished and how many ideas um how many I don't know trips i took and i kind of want to put them in here so that's just going to be like how much did i accomplish in 2020 all right and now for my main two planners i only going to have two main planners this year for now this one's getting a little dirty <laughs> this one right here is my first ever personal wide rings this is not fully set up yet guys but if i continue to wait on this video 2020 will be over and I will never record this video. So this planner right here that sits in front of us, this one right here is my personal wide from Print Pression. And I said when Print Pression got the sale going on with their planners, with the ring planners, I was like, listen, this is the best time to try personal wide rings without the commitment of having to pay more than $100 for a leather planner. So let's go ahead and look inside. This is the their white on white. Okay, so when you first open it again, like it's not fully set up guys. I feel like planner is never going to be fully, fully set up until you, I don't know, like maybe two years go by, three years go by, to be honest. So first thing you see here are just pretty much some die cuts from my shop. This is from Little Magic Prints. I love her stuff. Then these are just um, die cut stickers that you will find in my shop. I have them here because I was testing everything then these are some nice pretty brush strokes um stickers again i was testing a few items from my shop so i have them here um and then i have some nice ombre color effect uh, hearts so I have that sits in these i love the fact that these are crisscross you have a pocket on this side 
and then you have it crisscross and then you have more space in the back which I think that's awesome to fit like a lot of stuff in here. So in here I have a dashboard that I will be using for Valentine's Day. This is a six picture dashboard. You can find this also in my shop. This is pretty much for Valentine's. It has like be my Valentine's, it has love and it's just a pretty picture dashboard and it comes in a semi-gloss picture paper so I thought that was pretty pretty cute. I have this here, I'm gonna use it as a dashboard. Then I have here some paper from, uh, I think this is from Michaels. It's just a scrapbook paper and it just has like this pretty, pretty pink and gold effect. Then this is a jelly cover from my shop at the moment I am all out of the jelly covers But I will be bringing jelly covers in a few. I'm just waiting for new shipments to come in But this is just a, a light pink jelly cover Then I have here this planner guys. I forgot to tell you this planner sits only for my business So shop Instagram and YouTube. This is all work related So that's why I have like this boss little boss um dashboard from little magic prints i absolutely love it and then i did this little laminated dashboard says boss lady with some my beautiful my favorite roses in the back my favorite flower which are peonies then i have these um i haven't put anything in here yet but these are the um foxy figs dashboards and then i printed out the freebie from little magic prints here uh, for January 2020 and then I have the all of my printables in this planner are from Jessenia printables I love everything about the her printables. So here's just a pretty much a year at a glance I thought that it would be great to have it in the beginning um, Just to kind of see it. So here I have another dashboard again. I have nothing on it I still haven't found something to put in here, but soon then these are the dividers that I have in this planner. I didn't want to do tab dividers. I kind of wanted to do these dividers that are like a wind, clear window. These are available at my shop and you can choose from the trim color and you can choose your own wordings. So I have monthly, I have uh, weekly, daily, to do's and as I go on, I'll show you. So here I have my monthly. Uh, I decided to do monthly on two page because I like writing a lot of stuff in it. Then this vellum I printed off the internet. I loved her. I love the fact that she has tattoos. She has some jeans and she has some NMDs, which are my favorite sneakers ever. And I just loved it and I was like, goals. So then I have uh, my weekly. What I like about these um, dividers is that you get like that window effect. That's what I like. So I have weeklies in here. I haven't fully, fully, fully worked on this and played on her because I said I want to have it ready before I used it. So this was supposed to be this week, but I'm a little far behind. So I have the weeklies there. Then I have another little magic print dashboard. I have this pretty um, grid vellum. This is also available in my shop. Then I have the girl boss. No, this is the glam queen um, dashboard. This is also available in my shop for all printers um, sizes. So this is available. It, again, it comes in a semi gloss. Um, it comes in this semi gloss uh, photo paper as well. Then I have this release tracker. So pretty much I have to, it can track the releases that I'm going to be doing in my shop. I have to, like I said, I have to start doing it. So the collections, the release dates and all of it. So um, my shop is open already. So now that I'm working on a new release, so I'm going to be using this. So this is really, really pretty, pretty cool. The release tracker. Then I have dailies from her. And I love dailies like this because since in my shop and my YouTube and my Instagram, I do a lot. And also in the blog, it gives me a lot of space to write my stuff rather than just a little window having to put blog posts and everything. So I love the fact that the daily is all in one page and it gives me so much space to write on, which I absolutely, absolutely love. So we have dailies. Um, we have this today. Um, that I have I have to redo it. I really like this. I was just testing this out. This is from Erin Cundren um, Pencil loop and then I have another dashboard from Foxy fix That I still haven't put anything on it And then as you can see everything in this planner is goal oriented goal related um, hustle related Because again, it's my work planner goal to make an income while making an impact so this one, I was testing it out. Technically, this doesn't go here. This is a meal planner. 
Um, I will be removing this from here. I'm just gonna see what I put after it. I have sort of an idea what I wanna put here, but haven't kind of figured it out yet. So scratch that, that doesn't go there. Then I have this little pretty uh, mini dashboard. It's available in my shop, anything can happen, a dashboard. And then this is my to-do list. <clears throat> and then I have here printables for a list. So here I'm gonna put all my to-dos, everything that I have to do on a daily basis. And then over here I have notes, take notes. So uh, if I have a YouTube chat, I have a YouTube video that I have to do, I put YouTube video, do sort day with the campaign, all the details of the campaigns that I have to do and whatnot. So, and then the last page that I have, the last um, that I have, it's finances. And I love how this turns out. This is like a little credit card. This is from Little Magic Prints and it's customizable. So she put Frances Michelle bills. Um, I think I'm going to order a new one for her, but instead of saying Frances Michelle bills, I'm gonna put Frances Planner Glam finances because this is pretty much has to do with my shop. And then over here, I kind of have everything that um, I kind of exp uh, spend where I buy my stuff, where I buy the paper, how much the paper is, shipping costs, everything that has to do with finances, it's there. And then this little um, guy right here sits perfectly fine in here. And this pouch, I'm going to be bringing it to the shop so you can put anything and everything in here. And I'm still working on designing it, so I will give you more information on this pouch. And then I love how it has these little pockets also over here, so yep. So this is, guys, this is my setup for now for my personal wide ring planner. This is from Printpression, like I said, and then I have these little pretty um, charms. These are from Charming Plants. Um, these are just so pretty. I thought they would look great on this planner. So here you guys have it. This is my personal wide rings. And again, I have not fully set her up, but this is what it sits, works for. It's gonna be working for mainly uh, blog, Everything that has to do with my business. So blog, planner shop, YouTube, and both of my Instagrams, everything is gonna be right in here. All right, now for the start of the show, guys. Oh, it's my beautiful Aura Estelle Cloud A5 White Planner. I'm so obsessed with her. I take her everywhere, although if she's humongous, I take her everywhere. So this is the first humongous planner aside from my classic happy planner that I have. And I have to say, I don't mind the size. I love it because I love to write a lot and I love how it feels and it's just beautiful blush color and I'm obsessed. So with her, again, I have not fully set her up. It is very plain as you can see. Um, it does have like a like a small um, winter setup, but other than that, she's very, very simple at the moment. I haven't been able to set her up the way I want to because I've been working really, really hard. So this planner sits mainly for my mom life, personal life, everything personal goes here. So from meal preps to bills, to mom life, to clean, to pick up, to doctor's appointments, everything sits in here. So I have this beautiful, um, pouch i just put sticker and stuff i can put sticker kits in here cool thing about it, it has um a handle and i want to do a d in d in-depth video of this planner completely separate so i'm not going to go into details about this planner i'm just going to give you a little bit of what it has and what it holds and then in another video i want to show you everything that i have for this planner so i have like i said jelly dashboards will be available for the a5 wide um, I have this beautiful winter collage. I love it. And then I have this beautiful uh, that I printed the, the freebie also for um, Little Magic Prints. So I wanna show you guys in this planner I do have mostly um, so mostly the inserts that I have in this planner are from Jessenia Printables. But for this planner, I decided because it's so big, I decided to have these um, beautiful dividers. And these are also available in my shop. They're the scallop dividers in a light pink color. Um, and then instead of having like the words, I have them in icons. And I thought that hearts was pretty much pretty for this layout. So as you can see, I have hearts. They will be available in my shop. Um, you can choose between the colors that you want on the scallops and which um, icon you want to be popping out. So that's what I have here, guys. Um, this is mainly for my house, home-related bills, 
I have, um, I want to show you this. This is how the window dashboard, uh, the window dashboard or divider looks like in the A5 wide. I just thought it was very, very pretty. It says mom life. So here I have all my meal planner, my bills, my finances, everything mom life related. And then I have some Annie, Annie plans printables here as well. But this planner houses all my personal mom life things. But like I said, I'm going to be doing another video fully, fully on the Aura Cell, giving you guys all my thoughts about the Aura Cell and how I use it, what I have inside and everything. Because like I said, it's not fully, fully prepped and I don't want to show you until everything is fully prepped. But there you guys have it. This is my planner lineup for the year 2020. Um, this is just pretty much what works for me, guys. And... Um, I love, I'm in, I'm in love with everything, all the system that I have and how I'm going to be doing and trying to get everything in track. Um, I have a lot of goals and I have a lot of dreams and a lot of plans for 2020 and I'm going to be relying on my planners a lot because I feel like it keeps me motivated and it keeps me going. And to be honest, I just love writing stuff down because i get to see it and i get to remember everything so yeah guys there you have it this is my 2020 planner lineup as of the moment it might change later on down the road with new planners coming up but right now this is what's going to work for me this is what has been working for the past three weeks and i'm going to stick to it and if you guys have any questions on inserts and everything they will be all linked down below and don't forget to uh Follow my planner account and shop my shop at francisplannerglam.com. And yeah, guys, so if you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, make sure you do. I will be sharing with you guys more on how I keep organized, how it helps me organize. And pretty much if I don't see it on paper, if I don't write it and I don't stick to it, I will not accomplish my goals. So I recommend you guys getting an agenda, getting a planner, getting into the planner community and just kind of like organize your life with what is it that you want to achieve five, three months, six months and a year term goal when it comes to 2020, write your goals down guys. Every single day, remind, remember yourself of these goals and what you're going to do to achieve them. This is what works for me. This is how I keep myself organized with everything that I have going on guys. So if you have any questions for me guys, feel free to leave them down below. Thank you guys so much for sticking till the end. Thank you guys for watching the first video of 2020. I will be doing more planner related videos, but as well, home, mom life, family, lifestyle, everything is coming. I just was very busy launching my new shop. So thank you so guys so much for sticking till the end. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and follow me on my social sites. Till later. Bye.